Hi guys, welcome back to our channel. If you're new here, once again, my name is Chellen and this is Fandom NY. And for today's video, I will be showing you guys how to make another beautiful balloon bouquet. But this is a decoration for a gender reveal balloon decoration. And with that said, please stick around and I will show you how and we will start. So I'm using blue here. This is 12 inches blue latex balloon and the pink is 11 inches latex balloon. So we will inflate this. So we have total of two, four, six of blue and six of our pink balloon right here. So we will inflate this to nine inches or 22.86 centimeter. And we will also inflate our 5 inches silver chrome right here. We will inflate this to 10.16 centimeter. So guys, now all 12 balloons is already inflated. So what we're gonna do is tie this together, blue. Just like that. And then tie the other end as well and then put it like this so just like the basic the same thing you do the same thing with your pink just like that so you want this blue on this side pink on that side and you grab your silver your eight silver right here balloon chrome the same thing you tie them together put this on top of your blue right there use your 20 pound fishing line you can either use fishing line or 260 Q. For me, I always prefer fishing line because it's clear and you will be able to see it. I just lasso it right there. Or you can tie them. But if you lasso them, it's not going nowhere. So once you got it pull a little, it stays there, okay? Just like that. You put this on top right there. Where's your fishing line right there? Give it a little push and then shape it like number eight. Okay. So now you put your silver again in between your balloon right here and then your pink on top same thing just like that so when you put this on the side this is what it looked like. So this would be our base. So if you come and look at this, this is the pink side. This is the blue side. So just like that. So total of 12 big balloons. We will need our balloon weight. So put this on the bottom right here. Just like that and attach with your Alright guys, so this time I will, be, I will be showing you guys how to make this beads right here and it's just beads, two colors, got it twisted together like that. But in order to 
make it uh, to become like this, I will show it to you guys. So for the regular beads, we have separate tutorial video that you can check right there if you want to know just how to make the regular beads, okay, just a single beads. But with that said, this is 260Q blue and 260Q pink. So same thing with your pink. I forgot to show you guys, always stretch. So they're about the same length. And then attach this together, connect them, tie it together. Just like that. So just like squeeze a little bit and then two fingers pinch and twist so you do like that again squeeze pinch and twist pinch and twist and then hold on to your blue do the same thing on your pink So you do this all the way to the end and they will, they will just like twist on you. So at the very end, just tie them all together. Tie both ends together. And there you go, it got twisted by itself between blue and pink. There you go. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna use our balloon glue dots, attach them all in here, okay? So this one right here. So attach it, wrap our question mark with our beads. There you go guys, so you will wrap this all the way, wrap it all around, okay? All right guys, so I end up having five of these beads. So what I do is just connect them here, connect them to both ends right here. So here we go guys, we're almost to the end right here. So I have an extra beads right here. So I am gonna twist it right here. Twist this, so this is gonna be the end right here and then we'll chop this off. So make sure you twist that good. And then release this. So release that.
And there it is. There it is, guys, your question marks. All right, guys, so we'll bring this back here. And our question mark is finally done right here. So we will tie the end of our 260, our, our tail right here with our 260Q. So just wrap, wrap it like that. So we'll attach this string right here or your 260Q. And then we'll support it more with our balloons. Let's wrap this around here. I know it's not sturdy right now, but we'll support it more later. So there's your question mark right here. support that more later so I'll put it there for now all right so we will put this here just like that that will support your balloon right there okay so I will put balloon glue dot glue dots on here so put glue dots on your star to support your question mark just like that And I'll put some glue dots on this side as well, so it'll stay in place. Bring this up, and then attach glue right there. And then do the same thing on the opposite side, which is your blue balloon right there. So that will help support your balloon or your question mark. All right, guys, so as you can see, it's already attached right there and I put lots of glue dots here and on the back. So in order for, for that to like more sturdier, we'll turn this around right here at the back. On the back right here, so it's not as wobbly, we will add more of our balloon right here. This is your five inches chrome silver. I pump one, two, three, just so I can add it here for support. There you go, that supports your balloon. So if you turn this around, it's more sturdier now. All right guys, so there's a little change. I switch the blue and pink, so blue stays on the blue side for the boys and pink is on that side. So now to add more on our decorations, we will make some something like this. So I will show you how to make that one. So. Just pump air right here, just a little bit. So just a little, like that. So we'll make this two balloons into quads. there's your quads right here so we'll put this here somewhere like that and by the way I made two balloons right here so I will put them down here 
just so again it will support so just enough that it can fit in there and this one as well so that won't be like that will support so it's not a swabbly so as you can see I put it down here Alright guys, so we're ready to attach our balloons here, our quads, and again we'll be using balloon glue dots. Alright guys, so we're almost done here, so we have another 260Q to this. This will be on the side right here. So I will pump this all the way to the tip, just like that, just a little to the tip. You want two of this. So now put this here, tie both ends. like this find the gap right there Just like that same thing with the other side and then this two hinge and then you twist you connect them just like that so now we will be using um, we're gonna put this on the side right here just like that. So I made blue and also pink. So we will connect that with our fishing line right here. We will attach this to your side to the side of the balloon. side you do the same thing with your other side with the pink side there you go guys so we're ready to attach our vinyl sticker Here you go guys, this is the final look of our balloon bouquet. I added some helium balloon at the back right there to complete the look. I hope you guys like this. Once again, this is just a decoration for a gender reveal party. Please don't forget to like and subscribe. If you are new to this channel, please subscribe and give us your thoughts about this. Once again, this is Fabio Menwai. Thank you guys for watching and we'll see you guys in our next video. Bye!